Hello Pisces, it's my lady from A Lady's Way Tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 11-6-13-2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, and subscribing and setting up personal readings with me. Okay, some of you guys' exes are trying to come back. Or some of you guys are dealing with somebody who is dealing with their exes, okay? Alright, if you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. But, I feel like I need to start now, so let's get this show on the road. Alright, what's going on with the Pisces? Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. What's going on with the Pisces love reading? Pisces love reading, November 6th through the 13th. 6th through the 13th, 2017. 6th, 13th, 17th. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Alright, so it seems like somebody is violating another's personal space. So, since this is your reading, I feel like somebody may be violating your personal space here. Alright, um, this is like they, they violating your space trying to look for something, but they ain't not finding anything. This could be you doing this to somebody else, too. Okay, and it's because of... Man, we got a lot of friends in our business this month. So it's because somebody is talking crap about you behind your back. No, it's like your partner's friends. It's like, oh, maybe this, maybe he this, maybe she this, maybe she that. And it's getting your person to feel like they need to stalk you or watch you or set up little traps to try to catch you up, but they're not finding nothing. But it's like they're looking. They're looking for stuff. And it's because these little, like, hmm. Hmm. Okay. Okay, so it seems like, um, hmm. Yeah, you just basically, like, do what you want to do, you know? I don't have nothing to hide. You know, I'm better than that. You know, it's just like, I do what I do. You know, I'm not hiding anything from you. This is... Who I am, this is what, you know? It's like, you're not hiding anything. Everything is wide open, you know? And it's crazy that you got the arrogant card because it's like, do what you want to do. You know, you're not going to catch me doing anything. This is the first time I've ever seen this card in a good aspect. Like, search me, you know? <laughs> That's what I'm looking, looking at here. Like, somebody is just wide open. Like, I don't have nothing to hide. All right. Okay. So it seems like Wow. It seems like this person want to be free from you now. This person either want to be free from you or they might have broke up with you because of these accusations. Okay, so they heard something, or they saw something, or, you know, it misinterpreted something, and they tried to find you. They tried to catch you doing this stuff, but they, they couldn't catch you, but it's all because they wanted to be free. Look at that. Wow. Okay, so they want to be free so they can go back to their ex. Okay. Wow, so they, they did let you go. First, they start going through your stuff. They couldn't find nothing. Their friends talking crap about you, probably because of what they told you. And then you like, here, you know, you can look through whatever you want. And here they like, you're like, okay, well. No, they're like, okay, well, I don't want to be with you. And then I don't know where those cars um, went, but it could be because of baggage. This person feels like you got baggage. But those other two cards is like they want to be free because they want to go be with their ex. That's it. That's the whole reason for all this crazy stuff. It's not even just their friends talking this crap. Friends or family or whatever talking this crap is because they want to go back. Mm. Okay. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Wow. Okay. Okay, so it seems like... um. They feel, you feel like, you feel like y'all had some kind of connection, like more than just 
physical. Yeah, you feel like y'all had some kind of other connection and you just like opened up to this person completely. My heart and soul and you know, they, they want to leave to be with their ex. This is terrible. Mm -mm. Okay, so it seems like, yeah, this person is trying to use manipulation to get away. This just made my head hurt. Okay. Mm -mm. All right, Pisces. Love reading Pisces. Love reading. I just don't understand why people don't just leave. Why you got to, like, play games and stuff? 10, 11, 11, 6. 11, 6 through 13. Pisces, Pisces, Pisces. Love reading 11. 6 through 13. It's like, I don't know why people just waste people time. Like, don't run around. I'd rather you just jump up and leave me other than, you know, you just playing games to try to make me feel less of myself so you can go somewhere. I mean, I just don't. Mm. Pisces, Pisces. Dang. All right, so it seems like somebody may be moving out or possibly moving back with people they love. So it seems like you guys may be living together and you may be moving out. Either you're moving out or they're moving out. Somebody is moving back home to family or could even be back to their ex, okay? All right, yeah, so right now they're feeling like there's not a lot of love in this situation. You know, somebody want to... uh let go and go back to where they were okay mm. hey heck you know so you might be dealing with Aries here uh or just somebody that is maybe possibly got some kind of better permission position or promotion but it got might have had some situation if it's not a Aries that makes them feel like that they're better than this situation now and they want to go back okay so maybe they want to go back to their ex because their ex is better or got a better job or start doing what they told them to do before they left okay and seems like you know you may be the honest person that's sitting there trying to do the right thing, but this person wants to go. Uh-uh. Go, go back with the ex to do like, I don't know. Let me just read the cards. But this, mm-mm. Okay, so we got the Six of Swords reversed. It says, a statement of position revelation of non-private disclosure. A card of traveling distance and physical separation. So it seems like there's going to be some separation and some reuniting. And I feel like it's going to be from for people in the past. Somebody separating from their current and going to their ex. If they're not doing it or haven't did it, they're thinking about it. But since I've seen this um, freedom card and those other two cards, it, this is a, it's, it's getting ready to happen if it didn't happen already, okay? And probably within the next three months, if it's not a week. All right, so we got the Eight of Cups here. And it says, um, it may be time to move on and start new plans. Do not let your pride stop you from making the change. So it's like, you want to stick out around and work for this situation, you know, but it's like, there's nothing there anymore. I feel like you are the person who don't like to change up people like that. And you don't want it to end even though it's falling apart. Okay. All right. So we have the emperor. And this says, a person who is not afraid to speak their mind has strong beliefs and does not uh, change their mind easily promotion at work a time for success and advancement a great chance to make money a time of power so yeah 
this makes me feel like like even if this person leaves or not it's like okay you're not scared of it it's like when this person was doing this i feel like it did break you down a little bit but i don't think it broke you down to the point where you're not willing to go on okay I don't know why they're like this person stalking and stuff. I guess stalking and going through your stuff made you uh, more self-assured. Like, you know, I know this isn't me. I know I'm not doing anything wrong. Okay? So it seems like it made you more powerful in a relationship aspect. It made you speak more and know more of what you want. Okay? All right, now we got the King of Cups. It says a person of great education with many interests and abilities indicates that you will receive good advice, generosity from someone soon. So it's basically like uh, without all this situation, I feel like you are going to this relationship is going to end, but you're going to find somebody else who will uh, be more satisfying than the person before. Now, I don't know if this is a love interest or what, but I do know that. It's going to make you feel better. It's going to make you feel all right. And it's going to like get you ready for the person that comes next. I feel like the next person, it just made my heart warm. That might be the person for you. But I feel like you needed to go through this to get there. But that's all I have. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Email me and we can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.